Huge thanks and shout out to me and Freddie Chevrolet on Halo Boulevard with a new door plane for letting me come down and video their vehicles. All of our information will be in the description box below. What's up YouTube, Jay Malibu 0326 here. And today, I bring you this brand new 2015 Chevrolet Impala LT. It's gonna be a full tour as well as a startup of the Impala. And we'll go ahead and get started. So coming to the key, it is Chevrolet Switchblade key with your unlock, lock, trunk, and panic. Once you unlock the vehicle, your parking lamps flash, and your rear tail lamps come on. This has the autumn bronze exterior color with jet, ba jet black leather interior, power driver seat. All four windows are automatic down. Start the vehicle, you just turn the key. This Opening up the hood, you just slip the little latch right in there to the right, and then it opens up. It is hydraulically assisted. Now the standard engine for the Chevrolet Impala is a 2.5 liter four cylinder engine. This specific Impala was optioned up with a 3.6 liter V6 engine, shared with the Chevrolet Traverse, GMC Acadia, and many other GM vehicles. It puts out 281 horsepower and 266 pound-feet of torque. It has a 22-gallon fuel tank and estimated miles per gallon is 16 city, 23 hot. First, we will go ahead and check out what the interior of the Chevrolet Impala has to offer. Coming to the left, driver's door panel, we will go from the left and go to the right. Soft touch up here, soft touch down here, it is leather. Chrome strip here with black trim here. You have your chrome door handle, all four chrome door handles. You have your lock, unlock. Like I said before, all four powered, all four automatic down windows. You have your mirror controls and child window locks. You also have wood trim here with stitching here. Coming to the left of your Steering wheel, you have your parking brake here, gauge dimming, and trunk release. You also have this really nice storage cubby here, which could be used as a sunglass holder. Coming to your actual wheel, it is leather wrapped. Cruise control here, controls for this screen up here, and your voice command controls. Your audio controls are behind the steering wheel. Coming to your gauges, like I said, you control it from this pad here. The top of the list is speedometer, 
Trip A, average fuel economy. Fuel range, oil life, tire pressure, instant fuel economy, average speed, coolant temperature, and back to speedometer. Going to the left, you have info, audio, phone, nav, and settings. And all of that information will display on the screen if you choose. Coming to the middle, you have your Chevrolet MyLink screen, which does flip up and reveal a nice carpeted area with the USB. Clicking on audio. System. Going back home, you have audio, phone, OnStar navigation, settings, Pandora, text, and OnStar. Clicking this button down here on the screen reveals your presets. You have temperature up here with your time. You also have two vents over there, hazard lights, which is very nicely inserted into this panel. Chrome here. These controls are your volume, slash power button, radio, media, screen, flip up, and flip down. Seek both ways, home, back, and menu, as well as seek. I'm sorry, tune. Coming lower, you have your dual zone automatic climate control. This is how you sync them, automatic. You have AC here, recycle, different zones, power, and fan speeds. You also have your rear defroster as well as front defroster. And your CD disc changer is very nicely inserted here. Coming down lower you have your nice wood trim. You have a storage cubby there for your phone as well as a power outlet there. You also have two cup holders and your traction control off and on. You also have a rear backup camera with guidance lines and trajectory. Coming into your center console, you have two USBs, an aux port, a light. You also have a storage shelf there, and it is very nice and padded down there. Closing it up. Your dashboard is a nice material. Soft touch all around. Coming to your glove box, it is damped but not lit. And those where all of your owner's manuals will go. Passenger door panel has the same materials. Coming to the seats, it is cloth here but leather through the rest of the seat. Coming up here, you have your mirror and vanity light. You also have your old crap handles for all four passengers. You have your two map lights here. You also have OnStar right there. Up here you have your lights, OnStar, airbag, and your door lights. You also have a microphone. We'll go ahead and turn on our hazard lights. And our headlights. We will check out what the exterior as well as the back seat and the trunk have to offer. Now coming to the front of the brand new Impala. Give your turn signals there, halogen projector headlamps, and little parking lamp there. 
You have nice chrome trim down there. You have your chrome grill with your Chevrolet emblem. You also have a nice fin that sticks out on the bottom. Coming to your tires, they are Firestone tires. They are P235 50 or 18s. You have your Impala nameplate over there. Turn signal mirrors which are heated. Coming to your gas cap. Very nice gas cap. With your signature Impala badge. Coming to your tail lamps. They are very nice, nice tail lamps. LT badge. Impala nameplate on the chrome strip here. Chevrolet badge. V6 badge. You also have your rear, your third brake light there with your fin for your Sirius XM. Coming into your back seat. Very, very, very roomy back seat. And I emphasize the, the very. Soft touch up here. Wood, soft touch, chrome. Same thing as the front seat, which is very nice to see any car like this. Two map pockets two vents as well as a power outlet down there and a storage cubby. You also have your armrest with two cup holders, three child seat anchors, and your lights back here, coat hooks, and old blank handles with cup holders in the doors. Now we will go ahead and shut down the Impala Give it a little bit of a rev. Lights back in automatic. Wait for the revs to go down. And to shut it off, you just turn the key. Alright guys, well I want to thank you for watching my full tour and startup of this brand new 2015 Chevrolet Impala LT. If you have any questions about this vehicle, please contact me at Freddy Chevrolet. If you have any questions about future videos, please comment below. Like always, follow us on all social media. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you all later.